I have a potential opponent in front of me, and I'm the stand Because if they're already in a fighting stance, you should be in one too. Like go like that. He's like that. It's time to move. But he's just standing there, and there's enough space, right? So he starts coming toward me. See, I can I can respond off of that initial movement. But if we're right here and he sucker punches me really fast, I mean, no matter how fast your hands are, your mind's got to be fast. But if I get a little space, it'll be easier. But what if I can't control the space and this person is still being aggressive toward me and they make a move toward me? Can I hit them first? Look at his posture. If he makes a move toward me and we hit right down the center, he goes back on his heels. So what do I do? I turn sideways a little bit when I talk to him. And just in this context, I'll put my dominant hand up front. See, there's a, there's a difference, right? Plus, if he goes and put his hands on me, right, I already, have my, I already have my hands up. Versus, by the way, this guy threatens to straight right you in the face. I'm not ready yet. <laughs> See what I mean? Yeah. Versus the person is there being aggressive with you. Create some space. Change your angle. If it's verbal, try to keep it verbal. And you know, try to keep your hands up in a strong, right, in a strong but not escalating manner. And maybe they'll just do this and go away. But if they attack you from here, you're ready. And if you feel more comfortable like this, so you can use your hand, do that. But you see what I mean? We're ready. That's the whole point. So if you attack, I can just move and control the distance. I don't have to get in there and, and, and fight with the person. And if I do, I'll have time to prepare and get set rather than stand right here and try to be faster than his hands. Like when you do gun techniques, are your hands faster than this? Mine aren't. See? So that's just something to think about. Okay, let's line up.